I love being back here in Margaret River. It's where I was born, so I have a lot of deep earthly connection to this place. My ancestors came out on the second ship from England called the Warrior and settled here on the Margaret River mouth in the 1800s. I get to walk the same earth as they did. I want to pay my respects to the traditional custodians of this land, the Wadundi, Hibbelman, Budja people, who were here long, long before my ancestors, taking care of this beautiful land. For this commission, I was focused on the Margaret River area. I started off by collecting water from the Margaret River mouth to mix with my pigments. This is where the Indian Ocean and the Margaret River meet. And is home to a vast array of wildlife. I collected limestone from the sandy coast as well as charcoal from burnt eucalyptus trees. I used the Balga tree resin which has this almost beautiful ruby gem like quality. Margaret River has a Mediterranean-like climate. There are so many beautiful native plant and tree species in this area, like eucalyptus, jarra, balga, and carry trees, as well as stunning native wildflowers. The West Australian coastline is unlike anything else in the world with these white, white sand beaches and clear water. Because of its Mediterranean climate, Margaret River is a beautiful wine region. The soil composition in Margaret River is predominantly this red loam, which is one of the reasons that vineyards thrive in this area. Loam is a soil that consists of sand, silt and a small amount of clay. As a pigment it made this beautiful red and mixed with others it made this beautiful pink colour. I 
feel so connected to this area and I can't wait to come back.